Okay, runners making their way to the gates here for the running of race number two. The move to Cal Maiden over the 1,400 metres. Please take note, stewards have just advised that number five, Ocean Candy, was kicked in the mounting yard, so will be vetted upon arrival behind the line. So number five, Ocean Candy, to be vetted prior to the running of race number two. Field of six going around, one for the road, your $1.90 favourite. OK, 90 seconds off start time here for the running of race number two on today's City of Calgary Boulder Merrill Cup race day. 165, one for the road. The money continues to come for the two here, CJP and Adam Durant combining. $1.80 on tote for the favourite here. So Ocean Candy just being vetted behind the line was kicked in the mounting yard and as a result stewards had, have advised that uh, Ocean Candy will have the vet run an eye over her. This five-year-old Blackfriars mare, start number 21 today. Thanks Alex, as TOB Radio join us. Generation locked away, Ocean Candy still riderless. No news yet, Jolly Lace. Bit toey behind the line or ray with an attendant, likewise with the favourite one for the road. World ruler has been locked away as Jolly Lace comes forward now. So Jolly Lace locked away. Here comes or ray has threatened on many occasions, but yet to break that maiden status as one for the road is to come forward. The rider still well away from Ocean Candy here but no official word yet. So one for the road, the favourite comes forward here. Join in barrier five with the scratching of number one. Okay, red light on. Rider jumps aboard, Ocean Candy here. So Holly Watson back in the saddle, will carry the 54 with her two kilogram claim. Won't last long this claim. She's been riding Kalgoorlie superbly of late. The remainder of the line stand well. 1400 metres is the distance. This is the move to Cal Maiden. As Ocean Candy completes the line and the starter wasted no time. They're off racing. Pretty level line out, pushing forward early on as World Ruler. Likewise with the favourite one for the road. Settling down in third is Ocean Candy, just ahead of Generation being followed by Jolly Lace. And Auray settles down an outright last, spotting the leader six lengths. 1,100 metres to run in the back straight and it's World Ruler making sure it's an honest affair. Shows out by three and a half lengths, one for the road, position second. Third down on the inside, Generation being followed a length and a half, then to Ocean Candy fourth. A further three lengths then to Jolly Lace, who's on the inside inside of All Ray, who's last of all. They're strung out as they leave the 800 metres behind them. It's World Ruler showing the way by four lengths now as they go onto the Charles Street side of the course. Running second, it's one for the road. Third generation down on the inside, yielding ground. Ocean Candy starts to improve. Likewise, All Ray. And last of all, it's Jolly Lace. 
450 metres to run. And it's World Ruler still out in front with a handy break as they come into the straight. World Ruler by four and a half lengths. Now one for the road being felt for us to improve by CJP. They will follow to further three, then to Ocean Candy, who starts to extend. Then came all Ray down the outside with Jolly Lace. Forget about Generation. It's World Ruler in front with a furlong to run. Here comes one for the road, trying to peg it back, but it's World Ruler inside the final 100. Here comes one for the road, the outside. World Ruler just in front. The line looms. They hit it, and one for the road. The favourite gets in in the last couple of strides. Second across the line, World Ruler. A gutsy run today. Photo third. Jolly Lace got going late with all Ray. Ocean Candy was there as well, and a long last was Generation. Two, one for the road. Had punters a little bit worried at the top of the straight. But uh, has dug in deep. And one for the road. For Adam Durant and CJP. We'll get up by a half a length to three quarters. 125.25 the time here. So not a fast time for the 1400 metres. There is a bit of cut in this track. Two, three, six and four. If you've boxed the boulder postcode, you've got the first four. Two, three, six, and four. One for the road for Adam Durant and Clint Johnston Porter. Three-year-old gelding by Sessions from Cherry Miss and owned by the Oakland Park Stud Syndicate, managed by Neville Duncan and also Adam Durant, the trainer in the ownership. Number three gets second. Good run here for Nick Avery's world ruler. Pristo Sardelic in the saddle for the minor placing. A universal ruler gelding from Mercy Dash. That was start number six today. Owned by P. Whittleton. This is D. Pierce. Pierce Racing and it can seem. Third in will be the six, Jolly Lace. Nice uh, turn of foot when it was all over. Displayed by this three-year-old by Blackfriars from Joy O. Owned by Trent Brown. Blair Rennie. Trained by Ricky Brown and Lacta Ramolli in the saddle. And four gets fourth. That is all Ray for Helen Harding and Tash Faithful. Two, three, six and four, the interim numbers. The winning gallop, 125.25. The last 636.83. The margins, three quarters by a length. But it was one for the road who proved too good after some hard riding there by Clint Johnston Porter. The scratching was number one. Rusty Spirit taken out this morning. Well, that's uh, race two done and dusted. Race three is the next on the card. The join the new boom handicap over the 1,100 metres. A field of 10 to face the starter. Start time is seven minutes past two.